Hello and welcome back to my channel. I am Hot Mess Ness, MUA, otherwise known as Vanessa. And today is Mask Monday. It's the one day of the week where I come to you completely free of makeup. And today we're gonna be testing out this sheet mask. I saw this in the Halloween section at Walgreens and I thought it would be fun to test out. It is flavored sugar cookie called the Scary Pretty Face Mask. Scary and pretty. Now this one's a little different. It says before applying the sheet mask, cleanse your face with warm water, take mask out of pack and apply evenly, gently smooth onto the face to ensure good contact with the skin. Leave on for 10 minutes, remove and rinse with water. So most of these don't have you rinse. So I'm sure this one isn't that great for you. It's got hydro hydrolysized collagen Niacinamide, niacinamide, trellolose. Bless you. I don't know what any of that means, but we're gonna test it out today because it's Mask Monday and it's October. So that's fun. It is really, really drippy, really drippy. Well, now that this one's on the face, I can definitely smell the sugar cookie essence. Um, if you ever wanted to do a sugar skull makeup tutorial and you were too lazy, you could definitely slap this on your face. I am going to leave this drippy mass all over my face and, uh, you know, come back to you in 10 minutes and let you know what I think. In the meantime, really quick, like I'm going to explain a little bit about something that I'm doing here on my channel. It is called Vlogtober. <clears throat> I have not particularly driven to vlog. I feel like I have to find things that are interesting in my life and sometimes they don't always come organically. So I'm just testing it out. If you see those videos along the way and some of them might be beauty orientated, but some of them may not. So if you're not interested, feel free to not click on them. Don't worry about it. They will be labeled Vlogtober. So if there's anything particularly that you would like to see a video on that might be inspired in the Vlogtober, leave it in the comments down below. We can talk. Uh, 10 minutes, I'll be back. So it's almost time to rinse this mask off. As you can see, it's not adhering very well. But some of these ingredients, I'm like, what the hell is that for? And so I decided to look them up. The second, the first ingredient is water. The second ingredient is butyl glycol, and it's a form of alcohol. It's putting direct alcohol on your face, but it helps produce, it helps products dissolve in water. So it's a necessary ingredient when you're considering all the other things added to the mask that would need to dissolve. So that made sense. The second ingredient was betaine, and everything I looked up was not good. I, at this point, have no idea why it's included. It might be for some reason to help sustain the mask and all the ingredients. But when I looked it up on its own, it was not, it was not a good thing. Like don't use if you're pregnant or didn't know if it could go into breast milk, that kind of thing. So there's that one. The next ingredient, which is a good one, it's niacin and that is another form of B3. It helps for peeling skin, redness. Uh, Trellolose, T-R-E-H, let's try that again. T-R-E-H-A-L-O-S. How do you say that, babe? Tre, tre, tre hellos, tre hellos? Tre hellos. Tre hellos. So it's like three hellos. Three? Like tre hellos. You're making this fall off my face because you're a funny guy. Anyway, the tree hellos <laughs> helps retain moisture. Okay, so this is the third time I have filmed the ending of this video. This mask sucks. Don't buy it. Scary Pretty Face Mask is high priced and my face doesn't feel any better. As a matter of fact, I want to put a good sheet mask on. I feel like if you're going for the ingredients, like if you're reading ingredients, you're probably not buying this anyway, but Trehalose is supposed to be the thing that will lighten your skin. So might as well just buy that ingredient, 
They sell it from the ordinary. Just go that route. Unless you want to take some really funny Instagram pictures or you want to scare people because it actually scared the man. He's like, whoa, your face. So it was fun to look at. Not really anything good in it and my face feels tight as F. Okay? No. This is a no for me. It's unfortunate because I have another one. Maybe I'll put it on one of the children. As always, thank you so much for watching and we will see you in the next Mask Monday, which will probably be a DIY. Let's see if I can find some scary ingredients to put on my face. See you guys in the next one. Bye.